Alrighty, we got the big boar head get put on. Got a nice evening here after work. Gonna give her a nice little uh, run around here. So I'm gonna try to keep it headed east as much as possible because the sun's going down the west. And I know that makes that big old spot on the GoPro here. But so far, during this break in, I mean, it's got a lot more pickup. I've just got about a quarter throttle here, and I'm doing 25 in no time here, which would take me about <laughs> almost all the way down to this stop sign to get up 25 before. I mean, this thing has a lot more get up and go. Now, once I get the new uh, roller weights in the variator, it should help the uh, top end even better. It's, I'll get more RPMs out of it. But this, I wanted to try it on this hill here. Now, this is my killer hill. That, before, by the time I got to the top, I was doing about 15 miles an hour. Right now I've got uh, 25 and I'm not showing any signs of really bogging down any. So it, it zoomed right up the hill, which is kind of bumpy. So I am really tickled, pickle tickle pink with this upgrade and I'm thanking uh, Tom from the bottom of my heart for uh, actually he did most 99% oh, of the work <laughs> I guess I could have done it but uh, there was a f few things in there that I was pretty kind of cloudy on and that's where you get the expert in there because you make one little mistake in something like this and uh, can shoot the whole works and all that uh, trouble, all that money and uh, time down the drain. So we'll try this hill here real quick. Yeah. I think I can keep up with the wife's keep up with the wife's scooter now. This is doing great. Great, 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 great. Yeah, I won't be afraid to go out in traffic now. Well, I wasn't afraid of traffic. I just uh, <laughs> I had people lined up behind me waiting to get around. It was, I guess it was pretty frustrating for them and frustrating for me too. So here we go. switch over here and I'm going to take it um, down Adams Dairy a little bit then I'm going to cut up on uh, up on 7 Highway Yeah, I've got her about half throttle now, and uh, it's picking up speed. And like I said before, I had to like cram the throttle all the way open, wide open throttle all the time, to even get to go anywhere. And I'm going against a pretty good headwind right now, and uh, not slowing me down too much. And make a ride up here. And this is going to take me up to uh, back up to seven. Eight. Okay, now we're going to be in the sun, so I'm just going to have to. S <laughs> I'll probably uh, edit this part out since I'm going into the sun. 
and we'll get to the more fun part. But going up a slight hill right now, and it's, I've got 30 miles an hour. And I can't wait to get those uh, roller weights in on the radiator. That'll give you some a lot more oomph. So I, pay, I probably have about 35 percent more power now than I did before, which is a lot. I got her in three quarter right now and I'm doing 40. And it's not that level. You can see there's a few. Okay. Make sure we don't have a Yeah, we'll get the traffic out of the way a little bit because I'm not going to be any speed demon taking off. So. Here we go. doing 40 with three quarters of a throttle here. Yeah, it's not the most level, but I got the wind on my back too. That helps. Let's crank her up all the way here. Kind of keep the speed varied here on the break in. I don't want to uh, glaze the cylinder wall and get those rings seated properly. that shoe <laughs> it's still there well I'm pretty tickled with this it does a whole lot better than it did before a whole lot better so NT8 hats off to you for doing this for me and pull it in here and call it a Good ride. <laughs> 